Hey guys, Epic Review Guy Chris here, and today we're going to be trying to give you another epic cleaning tip, trying out the Swiffer Bissell Steam Booster. Alright guys, well I'm here today with my friend, and we're going to be trying out this new Swiffer Bissell Steam Booster at her house. She's got a much cleaner place, and I think people don't tend to trust my judgment on cleaning products after they've seen my house. I know how to use them, I just don't. But anyways, she was nice enough to volunteer her kitchen for us to try this out, and she's actually going to be the one to test it out and then give us her impressions about what she thinks of it. So you about ready to go out and try out the... Steam booster on your kitchen? Yes, I'm ready. All right, guys, we're going to get this thing broke out of the box, set it up, and then we'll see you out in the kitchen. All right, guys, well, we're out in the kitchen, and we're ready to go ahead and try this out, but I thought I would show it to you hooked up. Here is the steam pad underneath. You just pull the trigger to get the steam off of it, and these are the replacement pads you buy. They hook on pretty easy. All right, well, that's how she looks. You can see a little bit of steam coming off of there. So, all right, you ready to go ahead and try this thing out and see yeah. if it works as good as a mop? Okay. All right, guys, let's see how it goes. All right, so let's take a look and see. You got a really clean kitchen. Oh. So that's, no, that shows it works good, though. Because, uh, like I said, this is one of the cleanest kitchens I've seen. <laughs> Ten times better than mine. So if she can pick up this much unseen dirt, that steam is really working then. Uh-huh. Maybe it's getting, you know, like the deep down dirt or something. It's like softens it with the heat. Yes, I think so. All right, guys. Well, we're going to wrap it up out here. We'll see you back out in the living room to give you the final impressions. But right, we got done doing her kitchen floor. And it looks like it did a pretty good job because that floor looked like it was spotless when we started. So, were you pretty impressed? Were you surprised we got dirt off in there? Yes, I am. She's not too happy about it, but I told her that was so good because it shows it really does work, you know? Yes. So, um, I want to go ahead and drain the water out of here and get this pad off. I don't want to set it down in her nice living room. So, why don't you go ahead and tell them, give them your impressions while I go get this put away. Yeah, well, I'm like because it's uh, easy to use as um, no heavy as uh, lightweight. So do you think that's something that you would actually use on a regular basis to clean your kitchen or would you rather use an old mop in a bucket? I just need that and that's it. Yeah. I think a lot of the key with the Swiffer stuff is that if you have a home that's already pretty clean then this stuff works pretty good for maintenance you know. But I wouldn't try to do your big spring cleaning and scrubbing really dirty stuff with any of this equipment. But it does really definitely work better than just the Swiffer um, sweeper or the Swiffer mop that I've used. So. But yeah, so I guess we gave it a pretty good recommendation. I would say maybe like three and a half stars, four stars out of five probably. So if you guys want to check out the Swiffer Steam Boost, I don't want to block you too much here, <laughs> you hold it. You can go ahead and use the link underneath this video and I'll get you guys where I got mine at. All right, we'll see you next time. Yeah, thank you.